Hello everyone. Let's learn how you can use the page break. Let me show you what is the meaning of page break. Generally, page break is an option if you are having a large volume of data like this, but you wanted to print out a certain data in a particular page. So there you are going to in, use this option, right? Let me show you the print preview. Go to the file tab, then print. Here in this case, you are getting the print preview. If you see the page number one, it says one of five means first page. In the first page, I am having the data. If you if, if you can see from one to fifty, I am having the data in first page. But the moment I am showing you the second page, you are having the data from fifty one to one not one, right? But you wanted to take a printout from fifty one to hundred. So what exactly you are going to do it to set this? You need to go to the page layout over here, then go to the breaks. Right before you go to the breaks, you should scroll down yourself data and going over here one not one and select breaks. Then insert the breaks. The moment you insert the break, you can have a look. A line is there, right? A line is there. It means so you are you are able to print in second page from 51 to 100 over here. You can see a line. Let me show you the print preview option over here. Again, the first page, second page. If you see 51 to 100, now you are able to assign what exactly can be printed in page number two. But at the same time, if you see the first page here, you are having all the heading. But in second page, you are not having any heading. But if you wanted to add that heading, how exactly you can do it? Here you are having the option called print titles. You can have a look in the page layout. You are having the option called print titles. Click over here. What you need to do rows to repeat top, right? Here you need to click on over here and just click over here. Hit here and OK. Now go and see the print preview. You will able to see all the heading in each and every pages. See first page, second page, third page like this in each and every pages you are able to see your heading. Let me show you how you can remove the inserted page break. If you remember we have done the insert in 100 right for the second page just go over there so here you can see a line thin line it means the page break has been inserted over here to remo remove it what you need to do just go to one not one breaks and remove the page break the moment you click over here you can see the line which is there has been deleted now if you go to the printout and go for to page number two so it has been deleted just because you are having the heading here you are getting the sequence till 100 otherwise the page break has been deleted from here thank you very much please like and subscribe for more videos like this